And so all of masculinity is toxic, which, so there's a feminization of men that's happening. And it's very dangerous because when things break down, men have to protect women and children. And I guarantee you when, when they break down, we're in a civil society and we're fortunate and women can walk around relatively safe. But when things break down, in Ukraine, there's rape going on. In Bosnia, there was rape going on. The Yazidi girls would have loved for real, virile men to have defended them. So it's very important that we don't buy into this lie. Uh, you know, these Hollywood films that show this 110-pound girl beating up three Russian mafia and think This is all fantasy. You know, that men have physical advantage over women. So it's very important that we inculcate in our young people Chivalry, futuwa, mm. uh, this is extremely important. And mm. toxic masculinity is not enough masculinity. It's not mm. too much. Because real masculinity is chivalry. It's, mm. it, it's, yeah. it's chivalrous. So these are not men, they're beasts. And one of the most beautiful hadiths, the Prophet ﷺ said, مَا رَأَيْتُ أَمْلَكَ لِذِي لُبِّنْ مِنْ kunna." I've never seen uh, women who could captivate a man of deep inner core like you women. And Rumi said about that, he said, it's men of inner core that are captivated by women. Mm -hmm. it's, the beasts are the ones that dominate women. Mm -hmm. And our Prophet ﷺ was, he was gentle with his women. He said, go easy on the brittle ones. That's what he called women. And, and this idea of turning women into men and men into women, this is an inversion of reality. It's qalb al haqaiq It's what shaitan wants to do. Make masculine women and make feminine men. And, and, and we, we're, we're an ummah of fitra. We want strong, virile, masculine men. And we want beautiful, brittle, feminine women. Uh, Silence. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>